Friday. Friday. I was going to say Thursday, Friday. Uh, we are all packed up and ready to check out the Bay Lake Towers. Yeah, um, we are loading up the car and then we are off to Tampa and Clearwater. Yeah, so we've got the Clearwater uh, Sea Screamer booked for two o'clock this afternoon, didn't we? Yeah, um, it's about an hour and a half drive down, maybe mm -hmm. I think two hours, I think it says at the moment with a bit of traffic. Yeah. So yeah, we're going to head down to Clearwater, uh, ride the Sea Screamer. Spend a bit of time down there on the beach. And then go find our Airbnb. Yes, yeah, so we've got a little Airbnb for the next two nights. Um, it is a converted garage, I think, on the side of their house. But it looks really nice, really modern. Um, so, yeah, we're looking forward to that. And then, obviously, tomorrow morning, we'll probably go out and explore somewhere in the morning. Do some shopping. Um, we want to go and see the thingy, don't we? The manatees are down there. Oh, yes, we do. Manatees at the power station. So we might go and see some wild manatees in the morning. And the hockey game tomorrow uh, faces off at four. So we've got a fun-filled two days. So for anyone who drives out on the I-4, um, out towards Tampa Way, westbound. westbound, this is going to be a uh, site that a lot of people see and a lot of people know, is the Mickey Pylon! Yay! It's so cool. <laughs> it is. Unfortunately, I-4 is slowing down already, but um, roadworks. it says it's about an hour and 39 minutes, so we should still be fine. Um, our sea scream is not until two o'clock is it so we should hopefully get down there for about one i reckon yeah um we just need to find somewhere to park yeah we want to get parked up and have a little look around before we don't want to just park up and then rush for the no. sea screamer do we no To Clearwater? Yep, we've arrived, we parked up, um, paid for parking, been around to the booth, we've got our tickets already as well, haven't we? Yeah, so if you are booking the Sea Screamer, you can park in the Marina car park. You have to pay 50 cents to um, park initially, which is 30 minutes. Yeah, the first half an hour is 50 cents, and then you go around to the booth, um, when you check in, they give you a code, so then you go back to the machine. And uh, it's a dollar for an hour, so we've got like six or seven hours because we want to get the yeah. sunset and stuff as well, don't up we? To, uh, I think you said eight hours maximum. Mm. So we've done up to um, 20 to 8 this evening, which yeah, should hopefully now us, allow us to capture the sunset later. Yeah, so we've got to go back about uh, 15 minutes before, but we'll probably get back a bit before then, won't we? Yeah. Um, and uh, we're all checked in anyway, so we're bored. I think it holds about 30 people. It's a massive ship, which you'll see shortly when we uh, video it, but Boat. yeah ship boat <laughs> well there is we'll try and show you that as well when we go out on the sea screen there's a pirate ship yes yeah, exactly i was gonna say there's a pirate ship here i think you can go out and do like shows um, and things can't you so yeah, they do like a, like a pirate boat so yeah, yeah. So, yeah might be gonna, something for future we're gonna sit here for 10 10 minutes or so and then walk back around and uh, wait aboard
are back on dry land. We are we are back now to the big camera as well. Yeah, fantastic experience there, wasn't it? Really, really Amazing good. Amazing experience. We are in Hooters for dinner today. And uh, this is their menu. They've got quite a lot of um, options, actually. From experience, well, food's been really yeah. good. Which we can share. Just and, this one. Uh, yeah, and then have um, some ice cream outside after. Yeah, and well, if you turn around, we can see the sea. We can see the sea. But this here over to the left hand side that you can see, they having they have an evening um, entertainment and street forms and all sorts. So we're looking seeing all that is as well. Dinner has arrived. We have gone for the uh, chicken with the barbecue sauce and fries. How was dinner? It was really tasty actually. It was actually really really good and they get, we only went Very for the, filling. the 10 boneless chicken combo but I didn't think it was double that, it was huge. Yeah. But yeah it was big enough for us to share between us, um, really enjoyed it. And it only came to $18 as well with two drinks and the food so yeah. really, but really good. Really good value wasn't it? Um, yeah. We are going to go for ice cream a bit, we're just having a little mooch around to yeah. uh, It is 20 to 5 so we thought yeah we'd go up and down the uh, the road, the main road, have a look at some of the shops. Yeah, well, we might cut through in a minute onto the beach as yeah. well and have a wander back down the beach. Bit of nostalgia for you, so that hotel you can see there is the one Simon and I stayed in in 2004 when we had our honeymoon here. And um, this is actually the first time we've been back here in 18 years. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Yeah. So there's your nostalgia for the day. <laughs> Have a nice chilled and relaxed afternoon, haven't we? Yeah, um, had some ice cream. Yep, just been walking up and down the um, streets where there's some shops and stuff. Looking just taking the, it all in, really. Yeah, looking at all the vendors and stuff like that as well. Yeah, it's been a nice relaxed day. We needed yeah, a relaxed day. After, uh, day I say anyway. relaxed though, I've just done 10,000 steps. Yeah, but we weren't rushing around like headless chickens. No. Um, we are now heading back to the beach to watch the sunset. Yeah, we're going to find a spot on the wall, aren't we, and sit and Yep, watch the sunset. And then we'll be heading off to our Airbnb for the next couple of days. We are currently watching the sunset go down. I don't know if you can see it. Very, very small over there is a pirate ship. And they've just set their cannons off. <laughs> I can't zoom in any further, unfortunately, but I don't know if you can see it. But yeah, it's a cannon ship. A cannon ship, a pirate ship. <laughs> One-Eyed Willy. Yeah, it's like, One-Eyed Willy, is that you? It's very cool. Beautiful sunset, absolutely gorgeous. Stunning, isn't it? We have just got back to the car. Been a good day, pooped again. Yeah, shattered all that sea air. <laughs> but it was lovely watching the sunset though, it wasn't was it? It was really good. Um, yeah, really nice. Colours have changed again now, haven't they? So. Yeah, so we are now back in the car. We are now off to our Airbnb. It's about 45 minutes. Yeah, about 40 to 45 minutes from here, so. So we have just come into our little Airbnb that we're at. So I would say it literally is a converted garage on the side of their house. Mm. But you come in and it's very, very sweet. So you come in through the door and it's all one area. So you've got your bed here, little mirror, brother's way. You've games got um, games and a safe down the bottom. You've got a kettle, um, kettle, iron, ironing board. Lots of storage in there. And so then you've got the double bed, television. You've got the breakfast area here, from breakfast bar. Then you've got a little kitchen area with a sink, microwave. Oh, it's even got a little hob. <laughs> Really nice. Fridge freezer, and then you've got a really nice um, shower room. Lovely shower. Really, really nice. Very impressed with this. Yeah, really pleased. So we're going to unload and uh, get all our stuff in. 
We are in and sorted. Yes, a really good B&B. Yeah, so it looks like it's the garage because the garage door's on the front still. Um, but they've had the back converted into a little Airbnb for them for extra yeah, rental, which is really nice. Good idea, really. Yeah, it's lovely. Mm. So uh, we are going to settle in, have showers and go to bed. Cause we're yeah, gonna um, we're both looking at us. We both got a little bit burned yeah. today as well. I, mean, no, was... I didn't actually put any sun cream on. So. You never do though, do you? No. I have to because I burn like a lobster. <laughs> so we are going to sign off tonight we're not sure what we're doing tomorrow because the original plans of going to the manatee center it's actually closed yeah um so we're going to have a assess and see what we want to do but obviously there's no rush to get up in the morning no of course not so um we will catch up with you tomorrow guys good night